Colorado first. Well, it's such a treat. Dave Aguilera is joining us in the noon. What are you looking at, Dave? <laughs> I was just watching the story. We have the little monitor over here. I was just kind of, I get involved. I actually watch our stories. Which is great, as you should. <laughs> uh, yeah. Hey, happy Friday to you and happy holiday weekend on the way. We've got this nice string of weather about to come to an end by the time we get to tomorrow afternoon. 55 at City Park right now with just a few high clouds going across the area. Phil Curry in East Franktown has 52 degrees going on right now and it's mostly clear on the satellite. But look at this. We got clouds moving into Pueblo, Colorado Springs and out west. It's high cloudiness, but that's already some moisture that's coming off of the storm that's moving into Southern California and the one that will change our weekend. Look at all the rain that we've got over Arizona from Tucson all the way up into Flagstaff. If you are traveling tonight or tomorrow into Southern Arizona, Southern California, that might slow you down. There's going to be a lot of rain through there. They could have some flooding conditions with all the rain that's moving through uh, that area. Here's the storm system, the center of it, just still off the coast of Los Angeles. It is uh, 847 miles away from Denver still, so it's a long way away. It has a lot of traveling to do, um, and it is still expected to mix up with that storm, which is already over Seattle and Portland as they squeeze into Colorado tomorrow night into Sunday. So here's the way it looks for today, just passing clouds today. Tomorrow morning, we will be on the cloudy side here, already seeing snow moving into the south west and the western mountains here and then by the time we get into the afternoon we start to see a little rain snow mix start to develop around the front range. This is 4 o'clock tomorrow. Still clear out over the east. But look at the snow pushing into the southwest, pushing into the mountains as well. So if you're going skiing tomorrow, you'll have some fresh snow during the course of the day in the mountains and especially the west-facing mountains. And then once we get into the evening, I think after midnight, it changes over to snow for us, still snowing in the mountains. And then overnight, tomorrow night, into Sunday morning, snow from Denver out over the eastern plains with that system moving through. And then by Sunday night, by the evening on Christmas Eve, the actual Christmas Eve, I think most of the snow will move out. We'll just be mostly cloudy around here, but we'll have some snow on the ground. And then for Christmas Day, it moves on out of here. A couple of warnings and advisories down south could see up to a foot of snow in some of the San Gabriel Cristos and the San Juans with this storm coming through 5 p.m. today through 5 a.m. Sunday. So most of the weekend, it will be snowing pretty good there. Some of our northern central mountains, maybe about three to six inches of snow up up that way and for the Denver metro area, maybe about one to three here in the city. If you live in Parker, Castle Rock, Roxborough, Evergreen, you might be closer to three to six in some of those areas back up into the foothills, 6,000 feet and above. A little more snow in that area, but it's going to be very wet melty kind of snow that uh, falls around here. Today, though, a uh, nice day. Get out, take care of what you got to do. 50s and 60s out east, 40s in the mountains, and 50s out west. So our high today should be right around 57. 49 tomorrow with that mix in the afternoon. First alert weather day for Sunday for the snow in 34. The Bronco game is going to be cold, but I think it will stop snowing by then. And then on Christmas Day, 37 degrees, maybe a few flakes in the morning and then clearing. And then you get a present after that, 40s and 50s for the rest of the week. The last Last week of 2023 is almost here. Where did the time go? Where did it go? It goes so fast. Where did it go? All right. Yeah, oh, it's somewhere. not over there. All right, Dave. <laughs>